Hey there, YouTube. Welcome to Draco Ray Gaming. Today, man, we're going to be talking about GoldenEye 007. It's one of the most amazing games that I've ever played. One of the games I started off with in my early video gaming career and hobby. Uh, 1996, uh, 97 officially as the game came out. Nintendo 64 uh, was a hit. It was an exclusive for that console only. Uh, they never did a true remake slash remaster. Um, they did just come out with the enhanced edition for Nintendo Switch on January 27th and Xbox Game Pass. Uh, on Xbox only. I've not seen it work on the Xbox companion app for the PC, so we're talking about Nintendo Switch and the Xbox uh, Game Pass for Xbox only, uh, that you can get this game now enhanced and uh, updated a bit running uh, on some modern consoles, which is great, instead of trying to emulate it or anything like that. Uh, I'd like to go over the game a little bit and talk to you about it. We're going to be doing a full playthrough of this game, and I cannot wait to play it. This is one of my favorites, and it's a pre-Call of Duty game with four-player multiplayer and all kinds of great stuff. It set the stage uh, for a lot of games uh, in, in the gaming industry period for the first-person shooters on console as well as PC. As usual, no BS, no fluff. Come with me. The cartridge had four save files installed in it. You had these folders, these dossiers, dossier, dossier, dossiers, dossiers. Uh, let's use this one. Now, when you select your mission, bam, I don't have any of the levels unlocked, right? Uh, now, th there was always a kid. One of the kids would have one of these files. It would have everything unlocked, right? It was so dope, right? Jim Curry face, boy, thank you. Uh, and hey, don't, don't you ever, don't you ever go here. Don't erase it! <laughs> don't ever erase it. Sometimes you would copy over a wrong one too, it was brutal. And there was no like, oh man, yeah. This game actually had built-in save features, even though the Nintendo 64 controller had uh, memory packs that you could buy. So, you go straight up, you're gonna go, hey, you gotta wanna play single player, you wanna go multiplayer? But multiplayer, you can only play what you had like really unlocked, right? But the settings in the game was insane. Well, let's get started right now. Damn, level one. If you've ever seen the movie when Pierce Brosnan, Brosnan, Brosnan jumps off, <laughs> jumps off the dam into that, that whole part, it's, ah, oh, and he meets 006, ah, oh, it's dope. Look, you got three difficulty modes, okay? Agent, secret agent, double O agent. Yes. So, uh, what should we do? Should we just do a full playthrough on Agent? Secret Agent? Double O? And then, you, and then you can... And then you can even unlock a harder mode than that. Pretty good. Shut up, Dead Crumb! Just kidding. I don't know if I want to... Agent? Alright, fuck it. You said Agent. Bungie jump from the platform. Easy. Easy peasy, right? Boom. So, you can click start or next. So, everybody click start, but look, background. MI6 has confirmed the existence of a secret chemical warfare facility at the Bailamori Dam, USSR. Its heavily guarded location and workings are the cause for major concern. Nerve gas produced there has been turning up in the hands of hostile regimes around the world, and deals with international terrorists have been rumored. This facility should be destroyed with extreme prejudice. It's awesome. M, briefing. Yo, hey. The area around the dam is well defended against full-scale military attacks, but a lone agent stands a much better chance slithering his way in there. The easiest way to gain entrance to the weapons facility, factory, whatever, will be to get down to the face of the dam. Q had an idea about this. The Q branch, right? Oh, hello, Bone. Information concerning shipping and contracts is stored on a computer system in a secret ops room. So, they'll give you extra intel depending if you have, like, you're, you're doing those extra missions, right? Like, you gotta go down there and get the modem or the, the data off the hard drive and stuff, so... We can intercept the data when the backup's carried out. As for getting down the dam, use the bungee rope at the bottom, blah blah blah. Use the python gun and all that stuff, which he used in the movie. It was like a grappling hook gun uh, by Pierce Brosnan. Hardly a lover's leap is for money penny. Be careful, though. I hate to think of you falling for anyone else. <laughs> I'll see you soon, money penny. Boom! Let's get this started. Don't pass up the beauty and the work that they put up in this game. Look at the graphics. Listen to the music. It's dope. The way I found you is from one of your dual PC stream set of videos. I have two. Yes. I'm actually like dying right now because like I'm single PC streaming it because I'm running off the switch and I don't have to use my gaming rig right now. And I had to switch sources around and stuff. It was a nightmare, but we got it. We got game. We got my voice and the game audio. That's all we need. Let's go. I also had to like flip my camera around because normally I'm facing my gaming rig, but I have to face. I'm actually facing this way really right now. I mirrored the camera this way. 
It's weird, because when I'm looking at my face, it's like weird. I don't know. Oh, okay, yeah, these controls. Oh god, what's the shoot button? Ah! What's the shit? Oh, there it is, there it is. Oh my god. Ah. Okay, we gotta switch the controls. Here's the menu system. It's dope. Right? 3D models are dope. Look at the static and stuff. It's dope. Alright, uh, that's glad. I'm glad you found that video. I try to make helpful videos for gamers in the streaming community. And I'm dead. <laughs> okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Alright, uh. Nope. Uh, I think I used to run Kissy. We'll see. So, dude, did you know you could play this game with two effing controllers, too? Yes. Not a lot of people knew that. I'm gonna try Kissy mode. Let's try Kissy. I think I think that'll work better on this. Uh, and this is shoot. That's reload. And this is shoot. Okay. Yeah, this works better. Aim assist! Let me know how the frame rate is and stuff. Playing through the game capture, so you know how that goes. Oh! Are we going loud? We're going loud. What's up, punk? Reload. All right. Uh, let's see. And you're dead. Yeah, yeah, man. I uh, got a sweet set of Ryzen 5930. Ooh, nice. Ooh, nice. Nice, nice. That's good. I think I just upgraded to the 5950X, and I have a 3080. Some 32 gigs of Rami poo Some SSD stuff. And some megahertz stuff. Oh, this is dope. Oh, my gosh. How's it looking on the stream? Looks pretty good, right? Yeah, look at that frame rate and stuff. Okay, all right. The game capture, like, it doesn't look as smooth as, like, when you're really playing off the console and stuff. Like, for me, playing through the, at the software, but it, it, it works. It works. It's still a good experience. Watch this. You want to see a shot? Check this out. If I hit this guy... Oh, my God. Oh, die at the hands of Draco! Ah, ha, ha. These guys, this, this, this dude's like, this guy's hacking. And then you got some in the bunker down here? Alright, so here's the trick. Let's switch weapons. Oh! Do you think I can hit it? Oh. Ah! Draco! Stop! Crazy! It's 1997, you can't do that! It's not allowed! Who that? Should I karate chop his ass? Let me just let the. Who's shooting me? I need some ammo for these guns. Look at these. Dude, the AKs. These AK 47s are dope. Who is- who shoot at me? He's gotta be over here in the tower. Here he is. Punk. Oh yeah? Yeah? See ya. This game, dude. This game. Oh, it's a body armor I just walked over. I didn't even see it. What's up? I'm playing on your Switch! I only have a- I only have a Switch light. I needed your full-blown Switch. It's okay, baby Draco. It's okay. I told you. Just calm down. Okay, uh, oh, you know another thing we need to change? I hated that the invert system was reversed. Like, you can actually change that. Oh, and I can change this to widescreen, dude. Check this out. We didn't finish going through the settings. So, okay, we're gonna unreverse this to upright. Auto, uh, aim, aim assist is on. Hold, you can toggle the hold toggle, look ahead. Let's go full 16.9, dude. And then we'll undo the reversing of the Oh, dude, look at this! Dude! Yes! Dude, yes! This is a whole new experience, bro. 
This is a whole new experience. Oh, I don't get squished. Oh, I don't get squished. So, dude, are you gonna go ring the alarm? <laughs> no, you're not. Why does this guy keep trying to run me over? Excuse me. Okay, okay. I wish it was like full blown FPS, like where the right stick was like look and the left stick was walk, but it's not like that. It's split up a little bit differently. I did hear though on the on the Xbox version, the controls are wait, hold. On. Who made this song? Um the Xbox version, I think the controls are a bit friendlier. They kept the classic weird control scheme for the Nintendo Switch, which is like eh. I don't know. I keep wanting to push the right trigger to shoot, but see, the shoot button is the... Who the hell? Oh, you were hiding? Give me that. Little Timmy. Ryan, this membership, man. See, there's stuff like, I think on harder modes, you have to go back here to get to that computer and stuff. Like get the... Blow shit up. Okay, here we go. And then you can. I keep trying to do right trigger. All right, all I gotta do is jump off the dam. Look at these graphics. Look at the widescreen. Little lag? Where? On the stream? Let me see. 8,000 kilobits, no lost frames. Your internet sucks! Just kidding. Dude, look at it. Should I get some? Shit. Dude, this whole okay, you can go in the dam down and you can do okay, we'll do it on the next harder mode. Right now all I gotta do is get over here and just bungee jump. And kill this guy because I want to. Okay. This is the way to do it. Woo! So you didn't. Yeah, get in Ooh, nice. You got the uh, fiber? One down, one up? Nah, you got cable. You got 1,000 down and like 10 up. I know. Don't you lie. Oh. Yeah. Dude, this game is epic.